Restrictive versus obstructive. What does that mean? Well, it means this. Restrictive lung diseases, they have a hard time getting air in. Obstructive lung diseases, see, they have a hard time getting air out. Two different things. So you say to yourself, so why? Why does that matter, right? Well, here's what it comes down to. Your restrictive lung diseases are diseases that are going to impact and affect the functional units, being the alveoli. Our obstructive lung diseases are going to affect our airways. And that's really, really comes all, all comes down to. So what are we talking about here? When we talk about restrictive diseases affecting the alveoli, we're talking about things like pneumonia, ARDS, pulmonary fibrosis, pneumothorax, pleural effusion, atelectasis, hemo hemothorax. Okay, I'm tracking with you. Oh, okay. So things that actually impact the alveolar units. Exactly. You see, when we talk about obstructive pulmonary disorders, we're talking about airway disorders. And what does that cause? See, now we're talking about excessive mucus in the airways. We're talking about smooth muscle constriction, things like asthma, emphysema, chronic bronchitis, cystic fibrosis, bronchiectasis.